so this is literally the second time i had to refilm this video because it's about to be like a two-on-one type of thing because like the other day i filmed my update video on like why i stopped using epiduo but then my boyfriend had to come and tell me that my lighting was too awful and that the way my video camera was set up was awful and all this stuff so i had to refilm it so i'm gonna include that right here in the beginning and then i'm gonna include my little skincare routine while i'm on accutane so like a dry skin extremely dry skin accutane skin nighttime skincare routine basically so i stopped using epiduo because like I think this is what like over a year ago now because there was I think it was like around January or February I know it was in the beginning of the year maybe like 2018 that I had the stomach bug and so there was like a straight week where I did not wash my face and I didn't even care so I stopped using it so like I wasn't about to start over and like start using it again and basically like backtrack and start over the whole system again so i just stopped using it completely and it wasn't necessarily giving me the results i wanted anyway um it was like to a certain extent like y'all saw the picture that i posted and the video that i posted or whatever um it like it was but it wasn't so plus i went back to the dermatologist and like my acne was just too bad like i just i have cystic acne so like it was too bad they were just like you know what you need to do accutane or nothing like you have no choice so this year I was like, you know what, 2020, new year, new me, you know how it is. So I was just like, I'm gonna do it. So January 1st, I started Accutane. I'm on 30 milligrams right now. Um, they wanna up my dose, so I'll probably go up soon. Um, if I decide to start being a better YouTuber, I'll keep updating you on that, but we'll see. I'm used to having extremely oily skin because like, you know, acne prone oily skin usually are in combination. So I'm used to having really oily skin. So I'm used to taking care of oily skin. So now that I have really dry skin, I have no idea how to take care of it. So I'm using like different products and stuff. Um, and they're probably like to people with dry skin, they're probably really basic products. But um, to me, they're not. They're like new products that I could never have pictured myself using before. And now I'm using them and it's weird. And I wake up in the morning and my skin is so dry that I literally have a white cast on my face because it's so ashy and it's like disgusting. And now my lips are like dry and flaky and peeling and cracking and bleeding. Like I'm five years old and don't know what chapstick is yet, but it's fine. So um, let me just show you guys how I take care of my skin when I get out the shower at night or when before I shower or if I don't shower and I showered in the morning, whatever, you know my nighttime skincare routine for dry skin. So the first thing I use is um, Rejuvenique Oil by Monate. Literally, this is, oh, my lighting is making it so it's not gonna focus. It's not gonna focus. But this is literally the best oil I've ever used in my entire life. I don't, like I said, I'm used to really oily skin. So it, it's a dropper, so. I had to concentrate on doing that. I had to stop talking. So I'm not like used to using oil, but um, it's it's naturally based. I just press it into my face. Rub it around, press it into my skin. I rub it around first and I kind of like warm it up into my skin and then I press it into my skin. It's like a really lightweight oil. It smells really fresh and natural. It smells like, it smells like, it smells like fruit kind of. It smells like botanicals. It smells like lemon. Um, that's because it's an all natural based oil. It's made out of all um, botanicals. And I don't believe there's anything synthetic in it at all. They don't, this company does not use anything like that. They're vegan. Um, they're Leaping Bunny certified. So if you're vegan and you worry like, you know you want to know about that um it's a multi-use oil or a multi-purpose oil you could use it in your hair you could use it in your skin you could use it on anything literally before i put it in my hair actually i'm gonna put the excess in my hair i put it in my hair before um you can do an overnight treatment in your hair with this you can put it on your skin you could literally put it on anything it's really good at reducing redness um helping with irritation inflammation it's good at minimizing scars it's good at boosting your hydration 
in your face. This oil has the molecules, the molecular structure of this oil. The molecules are so small that they can actually penetrate your skin and get to that under layer of your skin, the deeper layers, and actually do work for your skin. So like when you're when you get older and your skin gets saggy and you start to get like wrinkles and stuff like that, this will actually help prevent stuff like that. It'll actually get in there and start doing work now. Um, it's made to be anti-aging and stuff like that. So if you're interested in this oil, let me know and I can help you get a discount. I'll leave my information down below in the description box so you can know how. Um, the second thing that I use is this moisturizer. This is one of those things that I, before, I would have literally been like, I'm never gonna use this ever, like, no. This is the Pond's Dry Skin Cream. Okay, this one kind of focused better because of the color is white. And then I just take, not too much, but on my fingertips, put it in my hand. Also, I just rub that into my hands first, warm it up, pat it into my face. And then just because I was using lash extensions for so long, I was going religiously. My lashes have never been good anyway, hence why I was getting lash extensions. Um, I just want my lashes to grow and my eyebrows because I'm on Accutane, so your skin's really sensitive, dry, irritated, all that good stuff. So I can't get um, my eyebrows waxed, which is what I usually do. So I'm trying to let them grow back and the only thing I could do is pluck them. So I'm using pure castor oil to try to get them to grow. This is really good for your hair and skin and nails too, I heard. Um, I just put this on my eyebrow every night before I go to bed. I wish it would grow back in this spot only because I messed that spot up. And then I'll put it on my lashes. And um, for an eye cream, I've just been using this little uh, Advanced Night Repair by Estee Lauder. Um, I forgot where I got this. I think I got it for signing up for an older credit card. Because <laughs> I needed another credit card. And I just, I'm almost out of this really good though. Dab this one in my eyes. Alright, and then just to top things off. If my skin, I mean, if my lips are like really like dying, like they're about to fall off, I use this Aquaphor Lip Protectant and Sunscreen. Uh, this is my best friend. Literally, this is, it's not, it's clearly not focusing. But that's my best friend. But people have been recommending this to me. The Birds Bees Hemp um, Chapstick. So I've been using this just to see if I like it. Um, so far. Smells good. So far, so good. But yeah, so that's how I do my skin. I take care of it while it's really dry. As you can see, it's really glowy now. And that's also my update on why I stopped using at the duo. So just stay tuned. I'll probably, I don't know, I'll probably post again soon. Um, probably next month when they up my dose if they up my dose just to check in maybe do like a little makeup routine on Accutane I don't know whatever y'all want to see um I don't know how to end this how do other youtubers end this like comment subscribe thumbs up click the little bell I'ma put I'ma see if my boyfriend could put you know my social medias right here at the bottom of the screen if he knows how to do that so then when I point at it it'll be right here and y'all know how to follow me if not, then I'm going to put it in my description box. And then I'm going to also leave the information so y'all can hit me up if you want to know about that oil. Because that oil is really going to get your hair right and your skin right. Like, look at this glow right now. It's that oil, I'm telling you. 
Um, but yeah.